Hey guys, Nate, the Otter Outdoorsman here. Now today, we're going to discuss matches. Now one of the things with matches that I've been thinking about is what happens if your striking surface gets compromised. How would you be able to light your match? Now the best, the thing I like about matches is their instant flame. I mean yes, you can bring a Bic lighter with you, but Bic lighters also get compromised. But how could you use some implements from your uh, fire kit to light this? I'm going to demonstrate that to you today. Just a couple ideas that I thought tested out and saw they worked beautifully. Let's get going. Because of the phosphorus in a match, one of the benefits of it is phosphorus is flammable. So one thing you can do, take a ferro rod. Takes a couple strikes. But once you get it going, the match goes. Sometimes it goes up pretty quickly. But one of the things you can do is take a few of them and even light multiples of them. And even if you have marginal material, this will help you out. A good striking surface. And there we go. There we go. That's with a ferro rod. The next cool way is solar. <clears throat> and this is going to be the last one for the methods that I've been able to figure out so far. Make sure that this is. And focus the heat on it. And let it with solar. Okay guys, so that was just two ways to strike a match without even striking it on a surface using ferro rod and solar. Now there could be other ways of doing it, I haven't been able to figure out some other methods. I'd like you to try and figure it out yourself. If you find any other cool methods or try mine out and see if they work for you. Let me know. Comment below. Post a video. But it's always good to know how to do things in alternate fashions. My name is Nate, and I'm the Otter Outdoorsman. And this is how to strike a match without striking it on the box. Have a good day.